Hello, I'm Dr. Margaret Rogers Van Coots, and I've had a radio show on Web Talk Radio called Journey into an Unknown World for over three years. If you've been following me and listening to those shows, then you'll understand that each half hour show is actually me teaching about the subject, the topic that I've chosen. And if you haven't ever listened to the show, I thought I'd share just a few of the shows. Yes, I've been doing it for three years, so there are a lot of shows, and sometimes they were two shows a month, and sometimes one show a month, uh, depending on what was going on. So here's just an example. I've got a printout here, so I'm going to look at it, uh, of some of the shows that we've done over time. Uh, we've talked about psychic development on different ways for different times and different purposes and reasons. So there's going to be a group of those that I'm going to put together and I'm going to teach some seminars. I'll talk about that in a minute. But here's some more examples. On the paranormal side, we've got the astral, the spirit world, the oneness, um, what it's like uh, when one has to pass over the death scenario, how we face it, what we do with it, that kind of thing. Then we have shows on more materialistic things like control, whether you should be or not be in control, um, bringing up a child, the different kinds of children there are on this planet, how to communicate with your child and your family, how to see that life is beautiful. There are also shows on such things as terror and trauma, things that uh, we get shocked by in our daily life and how we get sick as a result of vibrations and sounds and resonations and things that affect us every day when we're walking around just doing normal stuff and we don't even know it's happening to us. Then we have some things like weirdy things like ghosts in the closet, reincarnation, um, things that happen and go bang in the night or maybe you feel someone's touching you. Is it a spirit that's good or bad? How do you know the difference? That's another group of things. Then we have things like taking care of yourself, looking at your obesity, or if you're too thin, not eating enough, your diet. And we have things like dressing up to suit yourself and not everyone else. How you perceive and think about yourself emotionally, mentally, physically, and spiritually? Whether you really do believe that you are a complete person and able to do things on your own? Um, excuse my leaking here, but got pages stuck together. And we've got theology, philosophy, spirituality, religions of the world, things like that that you might be interested in that I've talked about over time. Uh, I'm also looking at my list here and I can see there's a program on archangels and spirit guides and mentors and uh, different things in the world that are happening. I'm also talking a lot uh, over time about forgiveness, how to manage a relationship, um, what you should or shouldn't do in a relationship, how you could see another person's point of view. Um, then I'm talking about my therapies like crystal acupuncture, pterogram therapy. I have many therapies, by the way, that I've created and I've written books about them too. So um, self-healing is very much a group topic that I've talked about over the years, mentioning different things like aromatherapy, reflexology, um, just general uh, laying of hands, Reiki, you know, there's all these different things. And there's the side of how do you know the difference between flakes and fakes? People really are genuinely very good at their skills and talents. And of course, that will include things like doctors we go and see and whether they're just giving you scripts day in, day out and making a fortune on that and not really helping you. Are you getting sick on pills that you shouldn't really be taking because there's alternative ways to help yourself get better? So there's quite a few shows about those kinds of things. And then we talk about uh, fear, pain, anger, guilt in different modalities throughout different shows. And of course, everybody is uh, in some way traumatized by some kind of fear, some worry, money, jobs, uh, kids, 
the guy down the street, the woman up the street, you know, there's no end to the different kinds of things that get in our way in our life. We want to move on. And this is very much now a time of change. You know, you, you can go online and you can see all sorts of people who are coaches and they're offering you all sorts of big deals, free webinars and and uh, lots of insights and inspirations and some of them are excellent but they're costing you a lot of money. I mean the first thing might be free but after a while then it starts to be buy this course, buy this book, do this, do that and before you know where you are you've spent a lot of money. I've been watching this and I've never come from a space of making a fortune I was born in World War II. There wasn't much to get uh, because supplies, uh, products were not available. So for the first 10 years of my life, I really learned to manage on very little. And even though the Western world has increased and integrated their trade, and uh, we have lots of stuff from all over the world, I still have to say to you that I'm very careful with my money and uh, not greedy to have lots of things. So most of the money that I make goes into my uh, way of helping people who need to be helped around the world. And of course, being a psychic and a healer, that was how I really birthed my idea that I was a fit person, if you like, to go into training to help people around the world. So I've got a long history of study. Um, I started nursing when I was 16 and I came out of that by the time I was 19 into psychology and psychiatry. Um, I was doing hypnosis long before anybody accepted hypnosis was something that could be done. <laughs> Found out that quite by accident because my voice was hypnotic. Um, and so, you know, over the years I became a minister and, uh, you know, spent many years from the pulpit in England teaching and preaching and so on, uh, running around helping people who were uh, in behavioral issues, um, getting them off the bottle, getting them off their drugs, you know, all these kinds of things in those days. Uh, and, of course, once I came to America, then I started to uh, expand all the festivals that I attended in England were starting to happen here in America. So yes, I was a guest, a lot of events, uh, doing workshops, lectures, teaching, expanding my world and reaching out to more people in the world because the computer turned up. And uh, today, yes, everyone is learning something online. And so I finally decided, you know, this is my uh, 73rd birthday in two days so I finally decided I need to get tech minded and so what I'm intending to do is to provide you with a seminar a one hour seminar on each one of my shows where I can work with you and a group of other people that will come online either audio or video to talk to me by chat room or to listen to what I have to say in exercises and things that we will do as we go through that hour. So here's an example of the kind of thing that I would like to do. Let's say you have an obesity problem. I will ask you questions and you will write down your answers. Those answers will be simple one-line things, for example, when did you first notice you were gaining weight? Write down, I was 16, I was in school, I felt abused. Something simple like that. Then I want to, I'll ask you another question, like how long have you looked in the mirror, for how many years in other words, have you looked in the mirror and said, I'm not beautiful? Write a number of years down. And we'll do things like that until you see what your brain is thinking. You see, all these thoughts go round and round in our head and we don't realize that those thoughts travel from here throughout our body and cause us fear, pain, anger and guilt. Our self-esteem, self-worth and self-value goes down. 
we begin to tell ourselves we're not capable of doing anything. Well, my job is to help you believe that you can do whatever you want to do. So whatever the topic is that I'm talking about, the focus will always be about helping you to get unstuck with your issues that have held you back. If it's a health issue, I'll give you advice and understanding anatomically, practically, in different ways what you can do in the alternative world of healing and of um, different kinds of hopes and things that I could suggest. I have to remind you, I'm not an MD, I have two PhDs. And so uh, I'm not a, doc a medical doctor, I'm a doctor of alternative and integrated medicine. I'm a, a doctor for being an ordained minister, counselor, healer, lecturer, and creator of seven therapies. So uh, there's a lot of history I have to share with you. And I'm hoping that you will love to want to study with me this way. So no matter which country you're in, you're getting an opportunity to pick my brains, ask questions through the chat room, and I'll answer them as best as I can. So what would I like you to do? I would like you to go to my website, Sumari Center, that's S for Sugar, U, M as in Mother, A, R, I, S for Sugar again, Center, C E N T E R, that's American spelling, dot com. Go there, sign in, opt in, in other words, and put your name, your email address, how old you are, uh, where you are, which country you're in, and um, what your main interest is, what you, what you would like to really study with me and learn with me. And of course, <clears throat> sorry, once um, I've got your information and I've got a lot of information from a lot of people, then we will decide on a date and I will let you know when I'm going to talk about that particular topic that I've already talked about on the show. So my first suggestion to you is if you haven't li listened to any of the shows Journey into an Unknown World on Web Talk Radio, then go to the link on Samari's Education Center so that it takes you directly to that page. And you can go down and look at the different topics. And if you really want to listen to them all, I suggest you click on the iTunes link and that will take you there where you can download all of the shows as podcast and you can listen to them in your own time and come to a conclusion as to the type of show um, that you've enjoyed the most, that's helped you the most and maybe is the one that you want to follow up on and do the one hour seminar with me on that particular thing. Now, here's the good news. That one-hour seminar is only going to cost you $35. And that will be payable through the website or my education school. That is samariseducationcenter.com. We will let you know which of the, sen you know, the websites, sorry, which of the websites um, that we're going to put the shows up on. And so your homework will be before you actually attend that one hour um, seminar that um, you listen to that show so that it's fresh in your mind before you actually come on to the seminar. When you register with the seminar and pay the fee, we will send you a key number for you to sign to get to talk to me and be with me on that day. And there may be many people who sign up, but I will be monitoring the chat room and I will be uh, available at times. I will say any questions. So we'll have open mic and as I said I will give you different things to do while we're working through that hour to help you evolve from the space you're in. Get unstuck and move on. So I hope that you will watch this uh, either on Facebook, Twitter or somewhere. I'm going to put it out there in the world. And then go directly to sumaricenter.com and opt in so that I can let you know when we start doing these seminars. I'm calling them seminars because that's what they are. They're one hour 
of plain and simple education to help you move on. I'm not asking you to do any long-term event or thing with me. If you do decide, yes, I do have packages, but that is just something you would decide privately by reading and going into samaricenter.com. I'll be there for you in that way if that's what you want. But right now, I'm just about teaching as many people as I can in a very simple way for as little money as possible. So once again, I ask you, share this video with anyone you believe would be benefiting from learning with me for one hour. And please share it across the world. Anyone who speaks English, of course, is invited. Unfortunately, I don't have interpreters for every, every different language in the world. So it's in English. So Australia, New Zealand, America, Britain, and any of the other countries that speak uh, English in um, so many countries I know do. So please do share and hopefully we'll be able to help a lot of people around the world to find a balance in themselves so that we can actually begin to bring peace and order to the way we live in our world. Our societies must find a balance and that always begins with ourselves. So my destiny, if you like, is to help you find the balance in yourself. Thank you so much for listening to the whole of this video. And thank you once again for trusting me and listening to my shows. Bye for now. Wait, to switch it off. Bye.